Welcome to Dreyon Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a yellow square. Uh, and this yellow square has ab above it as a green uh, trapezoid with an area of 16 square units and a height of 4 units. And we have above the green triangle a blue, uh, the green trapezoid a blue triangle of unknown area. And this uh, height of the uh, yellow, uh, blue triangle has a length which is equal to the side of the square. And we are required to find the area of the blue triangle. Okay, so first thing we need to do is we need to label this blue triangle as A. And since we are interested in uh, getting this, about this, the area of this blue triangle, then we, and since that blue triangle is similar to this uh, blue triangle with this trapezoid, uh, that means a uh, blue triangle plus trapezoid is also a, a similar triangle that is also a triangle which is uh, similar to this blue triangle, this smaller blue triangle. Okay, so next is we compare this uh, small blue triangle in terms of area to this to this combination of this blue and this uh, tra uh, trapezoid. So this is also a triangle similar to the smaller triangle, the blue triangle. So we have a over a plus 16. So it is equal to the length which is this length so this let's label this length as uh, x i yes x and since that is equal to this this length is equal to this length so we can label this as x also so this is x okay so it is equal to this length x over this uh, x plus 4 because it is x plus 4 is this corresponding to the larger triangle so this is x plus 4 okay so let us set aside that equation and we actually need since we need to focus on this uh, uh, blue triangle. Okay, so if this length is x, then we can actually draw a line which is also x and downwards which is also x. And this becomes actually the square which is congruent with the yellow square. So this can this is x and x and x. And we can actually continue this down this downwards. Okay, so I have drawn this uh, lines and this uh, is actually also x and this is x. And this uh, length is force x. And uh, this diagonal, given diagonal, uh, divides this biggest rectangle into two equal parts. And therefore, uh, this should be also 16. And if the, that's, that is 16, then the total area is 32. And if the total area is 32, so 32 is equal to uh length times width times the width and 32 is equal to length times the width is 4 so length is actually equal to we divide both sides by 4 so l is equal to 8
So n is actually x. So x is equal to n is equal to 8. So x is equal to 8. Okay, so we need to replace this um, x with 8. So we have area, check all over area plus 16 is equal to 8 plus uh, 8 plus 4. Okay, I, I forgot we need to square this. So we need to square this and this. So we have this 8 over 12. But you need to square this. So area over area plus 16 equal to that. Okay, so 8 over 12 is actually divide this by 4. We have 2. Okay. And this, we divide this by 4, we have 3. So this becomes 4 over 9. So by squaring this, 2 square is 4. And 3 square is 9. So it's equal to area area plus 16. So we just cross multiply with 9a is equal to 4 times a plus 16. Okay, so 4a plus 16 times 4 is 64. 9a is equal to 9a minus 4 is 5a equal to 64. So we divide both sides by 5. And we have area to be to have the value of 12.8 uh, square units. And that is our answer. Okay, so thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And Subscribe. don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.